Well, that was a little bit more difficult than I anticipated, but nobody died, so as long as nobody dies, it's, uh, it's fine. It's perfectly fine. Okay, so Tavi and Shadowheart are still have poison resistance, so they can walk into this huge poison cloud area. Need to find a way forward. And how do we we need to find something to put on these vents? Uh pills. Torchlight won't last long here. Oh the curse. The anything of use? The bloody curse. I forgot about the bloody curse. Okay, Tavi. Um, Gail, I do need to borrow. Even fire is swallowed. In. I need to borrow that. Tavi, I, I need to borrow that quickly. No one back home will ever believe this. <sighs> Let's get going. Oh, I still... Okay, that's still not gonna work. Because now these people... Okay, this stinks. How do I keep everybody together? Mage Hand. We can do Mage Hand. Okay. Tavi's got a Mage Hand, right? Yes. Tavi does have a Mage Hand. Tavi can... Cast a mage hand. And with the mage hand, the mage hand has vanished. Well, that was very effective. <laughs> okay. The mage hand was killed. Um. Ba doop, boop, 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 doop. So, basically what we need to do is send Karlak Attention. and Gale back to camp. Wait at camp for a bit, please. You're not needed right now. Okay, so now if not over, Tavi and Shadowheart can go in here and deal with the poisons. Tavi can disarm. Uh, DC 14 with guidance. That is a failure. Uh, we do have another roll. Let's roll again. That is another failure. That's another two. Oh, that was even worse than the first one. Can we try again? Let's just try again until we get it. <laughs> there we go. There's a 17. Got one. Strange. The dust on the leftmost door has been wiped clean. That's not strange. Alright, we can cover up that one. Um here's a crate we can move on top of this vent. The dust on the leftmost door, so that would be that one, I presume. Uh, where's the other vents? There's a vent. Can we put a vase on top of it? 
Does that stop it? Yeah, it does. Okay, a vase is good enough. And I don't see anything to put on this one, so I'm just going to try to disarm it. With guidance. Uh, low roll. I don't think I'm going to make it. Ah, oh, with guidance. A 15, one point above what I needed. And there is some more poison back there. So it still kind of looks like there's poison here. Even though there's a box. Let's disarm it. Rolled low again. Not going to make this one. Nope. One off. I've rolled low on every single one of these. One more time. This is my last trap disarm kit. Got that one. Uh, are we sure that's... This doesn't really seem like it's working well enough. Alright, let's do one, one more disarm here. 15! Yay! Okay, so there's a... Uh... There's a more lab door ahead, a metal door to the right, and double doors to the left. Okay, I think we can bring the rest of the team back now. Assuming they all come back. They're all they're going to come back in the wrong place though. Let's go back out here. Have to keep going. Kind of a pain to do all this. I didn't mean to do that. Did not mean to do that at all. Alright, let's group everybody together and then go back. <laughs> They're not getting the shadow curse, right? They're fine. They should be fine. Okay, I kind of want to give this thing back to Gale. Uh, so let's do that. At the ready. didn't work. Oh, that was weird. Okay. Okay, Gale now has the thing. Tavi's gonna put back her Phalar Aluve sword. Okay, everything's back to normal. Whoa, did I hit O accidentally? I guess I did. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Okay, now I think we can all safely walk in here. Right? Right. Let's do a quick save. Gale and Karlak don't seem to want to walk in though. They, for some reason, leaped. Why did you do that? Why is everything acting so weird? 
All's well that ends not as bad as it could have. These boots have seen everything. Why isn't Karlak keeping up with the group? What a charmer. Because there is poison everywhere still. Let's There's go. still poison everywhere. Uh. What the hell? Okay, well... <laughs> I am... Uh, I guess we have to use poison... No, I mean, just leave... Just let them get poisoned, whatever. Does it even matter at this point? At the ready. What are you doing, Carlac? <laughs> what are you even doing? All right, we're gonna open the door that it said that there was less dust or something. Did I do a quick save? I don't remember. I'm doing it now. What the hell? This is too strong. My torch won't stay lit. Why did I just go charging into the room for no reason? Why is everything so screwed up in here? Why won't anybody stay together even though they're grouped? Ugh. This is so annoying. That's why they won't stay together because there's still poison everywhere. Now, Carlax. Go for a good meal. Gotta get in here. Can't reach destination. She's gotta jump, I guess. Man, this is super irritating. Super fiddly and annoying. No, never mind. Okay, we got. Looks like. Some research notes and a body, a dead harper. Let's be on my way. Who's this? He's got a necrotic laboratory spare key. Handy. And a gold ring and some gold. Spell. Remove shadow curse. Possible? Variant on remove curse. Dispel magic. Other? Recitation. Umbra resuscitit. Ineffective. Nox exitus. Ineffective. Nox fit lux. Potential. Nox finio. Potential. Vita in umbra. Ineffective. Vita cava. Unintended consequences. Living armor. Gesture. A number of spellcasting gestures are traced beneath. Hmm. Well, I guess we'll pick up the research notes. So there's apparently some sort of variant of Remove Curse that could remove the Shadow Curse. Olam's Journal, Day 2 of Darkness. I stood calm as Ketherick uttered his final curse and then withered. As my fellow Harpers dragged his putrid corpse from the battlefield, I allowed myself to feel relief, even solace. A wrong had been righted, an evil thwarted, victory had come. But I had yet to know its true cost. The darkness shrouded the land like a vast cloak. It began as a chill, as if the claw of winter had gripped us. Within hours, every breath was a dagger piercing my throat. I hungered for air like a wolf hungers for meat, yet I could still get my fill thanks to my armor. Would that the men and women of Rythwin had been so well equipped. One by one they fell, only to rise as shadows themselves, intent on extinguishing all light and all life. The shadows hang less heavy in this place. It still takes some effort to fill my lungs, but better to expend effort than to unite with darkness. My traps should keep me safe, or at least safe enough. Day 5 of Darkness The shadows ebb and wane. A torch flame is sometimes enough to burn them away, but no light can dispel the deepest of them. I called my familiar Corvin to my side, but he could scarcely take wing. Tomorrow I search, and not just for food and drink. I might find a scroll or an artifact, or an arcane focus that can ward off this curse. Perhaps I might even find another survivor. 
day 18 of darkness. It's a particular loneliness in these shadows. Corvin shows great affection when I call him, even as he suffers. Those few minutes are at least some comfort for both of us. It is remarkably still in here, and even stiller out there. I have found a few scrolls and books near the House of Healing, as well as some scattered artifacts, but they hold nothing for me. The only answers will call out from within the house itself, where I dare not enter. I hear the moans of the anguished, the shouts of the cruel. There are those who make their home in the shadows, but I am no less alone for them. The answers call out from within the house itself. Day 26 of darkness. I called on Corvin yet again, but I cannot bear his torment, nor can I bear my own. Grey has turned almost to black, and the air might as well be molasses or tar, so hard as it is to choke down. All beings should walk free of fear, I was taught. Oh, if only I were granted such a fine fate. Hmm. The Blessed's Final Rest. Tavi is inspired. This will make a fine song someday. We got an inspiration point, and we have a chest. Everybody's getting inspired by this book. With a flick of the wrist. Doing a uh, dexterity check to open this chest. 19 for a DC 14 check. Unlocked. Inside is uncommon clothing. Time thoroughly bided. The wearer gains arcane charge whenever they are hit by a melee attack. Revenge is best served. Hot or cold makes no difference. Well, that certainly sounds like something that Gale should be wearing immediately. Have we finally found... some... some decent mage robes for Gale? Yeah... Awesome. He's got four arcane charges now. He should probably just use one to get a level one spell back. He's got all of his spell slots. I'm ready. Shadowheart is missing a bunch. Shadowheart used up a bunch of spell slots. Uh, Karlak's gonna okay. help her get uh, a level one back. Hold still. Hold still, soldier. And one more for ya. Oh. oh, it hurts so much when you do that, Karlak. No time to dally. All right. Never a dull moment. Okay, well, we got through this room. All we got was inspiration, though. Now we have to go back out into the poison. To the easy path. Where people will not want to go. No rest for the wicked, I see. I'm going to force Gale to go first. Hey, please, Mistra. Uh, uh. And he's poisoned. Carlac can't move. No! Oh, god damn it. <laughs> this came. Uh. A long way from Waterdeep. Adventure awaits. Okay. I feel like we just need to enter turn based mode and do it this way because it's just <laughs> such a tedious pain in the butt to walk around in this room. Uh, let's go open the, the door to the right, I guess. Um, 
Um, Carlac, trying to select Carlac. Yeah. Dashing over to the door. This one's got blood stains on it. What's next, I wonder? Onward. Ever onward. Ever onward. Moving in. Okay. My will guide me. Somebody open the door. Oh, Tavi's got to open the door. Mm. I applaud your taste. The door is locked. Gail's poisoned again, even though there's no poison. We have the key, though, don't we? No, we don't. Lock pick. A couple turns should do it. With guidance. Oh, this is a DC 30. Can we not do this? No, we're stuck doing this. Well, let's get a boon. What happens if I click this X? Nothing. Okay. There's no way to... Oh, there is a way to cancel out. Okay, it's way up in the upper right corner. There's a tiny little X that nobody could possibly ever see. Okay, well, moving on then. Let's ride. Got We're going turn-based to move from here to that door because the mechanics of the game are so annoying that it makes it really difficult to move around. Juggling the, the moon lantern and all the little poison areas that people won't walk in. Oh. Really irritating. Super irritating. There better be something cool. Don't everything. Is all I got to say. Find my step. My face protects me. No time for Danny. You're always going on and on about your oh, feet. You, thanks. La la la. To yes. Gail. My pleasure. What to do? Then we'll do How Tavi. Dashing to the door. Dashing to the door. What's next? On I go. So boring doing it this way. Soldier. But what choice do we have? And she's poisoned again. Can we exit turn based mode now? At least things have stayed interesting. Grouping. Opening. Oh, it's. This one's locked too. Yes, this one we have a key for. Okay. Quick save? Anyone? This room looks fun. I don't see any enemies. I do see a big lever, though. Can't slow down. Karabasan's poison. Huh. What's that for? Everybody's perception check failed to see the lever that we can all plainly see there. I discovered all too late that I was making things much harder on myself than necessary. There was no need for such complex chemical experimentation. No, foolish me. I ought to have turned to that which has already been perfected by nature. Fortunately, my research led me to the carapace of the carrion crawler. 
which contains a paralytic agent so powerful, I must be quite cautious not to breathe it in during the refinement process, lest I fall asleep at my workbench. Uh huh. Surgeon's notes. So we can make poison. Wait. Oh, the po- oh, here's the poison itself here. Carabassin's poison. Coat your active weapon with poison. Targets must succeed a constitution, save, or become paralyzed and poisoned. The base for the sticky membranous poison was scraped from the carapace of a carrion crawler. Hmm. Okay, tissue and organ register is over here. Donor, unidentified gnome. Donor, unidentified dwarf. Donor, unidentified human. The list goes on. The final entry includes an extensive note inked in a flowing script. Kethrick promised the finest of specimens, yet Balthazar provides naught but dregs for my research. A spleen here, a finger there, an intact head if I'm lucky. That bloody necromancer has kept the finest cadavers for himself. I will talk to my nephew. Whether he listens is another matter. Hmm, must be the notes of, uh, the guy we dispatched. Kethrick Thorm must be the nephew of... of the, um... Seriously, we can't... <laughs> The lever is literally right there. We can't click on it. Okay, that's very cool. Ah, potion of greater healing. Carlac, you should have that. Hmm. And a potion of superior healing. A trap where? Oh, a trap there on the chest. Okay. Carlac will take the potion of superior healing as well. And an elixir of heal giant strength. And there's a blood bank log. Whoops, which she just pocketed. Blood and bodily fluid log. Addendum the first. It is no longer necessary to log names. Race or creature type is sufficient. MT. That would be Malus Thorm. Addendum the second, you will either, you will use either the term donor or vessel when describing a source of extraction. Victim is an ugly and inaccurate word. Uh, duh, 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 a bunch of names, a bunch of humans, live extraction, ogre, half-elf human ogre. Cause of death, fatal wounds to skull and torso, corpse confiscated by Balthazar. Uh. Oh, is that... <laughs> that must be... That must... Must be his flesh golem. Let's move. Alright. Don't waste a step. Let's try to disarm this opulent chest trap. Some guidance, please, Shadowheart. And some bolstering magic boon as well. We don't want to fail this. And we didn't. 24 for a DC 14 check. And now we have to pick the lock. We'll do the trick. With all the same bonuses. It's a 26 on a DC 14 lock picking attempt. Inside is a ring, the Eversight ring. The wearer cannot be blinded. One of the relics of Deep Dwara's rebellious children. Paranoid by nature, Dwara had erected a vast array of biting, blasting, blinding traps and safeguards to keep her enemies from gaining her sanctum. Of course, this also meant her children were sealed in with her by those same deadly measures. Um, that feels like... Carlac. 
Well, that's gonna overburden her, really? Maybe Shadowheart? Shadowheart could probably use that. I mean, it doesn't matter. It's gonna be helpful to whoever wears it. Shadowheart's not wearing any rings. Eh, she is now. She's immune to blindness. Um, okay. Anything else in here? This just looks like story elements here. Not really much to, uh, to see. Why can't we get into this door, this though? Way. Still alive, so that's progress. Are you kidding me? Why isn't everybody else going there, too? Why is everybody else standing around? Shadowheart, what? Why? A long way to go still. This I, I'm just so. I'm just so annoyed with the mechanics in this area. It's just so annoying. Why isn't everybody staying together? Ah, excellent choice. Yes. Can you just, like, ignore the poison and stay together? Let's just peek around here to see if there's a key anywhere. Probably not. Cauldron. Don't pick that up. He picked up the cauldron. Alright, we gotta head back out into the poison area. So this will be fun. This will be super fun. Can we try to stay together, everyone? Is that possible to do? Trying to stay together. Okay, Tavi is going to attempt. I've got a long road ahead. It's gonna attempt a lockpick on this door. Bet I can crack that open. Uh, I wouldn't bet on it. You've only got. Yeah, you're not getting this door. Not even close. Plus two. You've only got. No, you don't have plus ten. So never mind. Oh, there's a lever here. Can we just pull the lever? Stuck from this side. I should look around. Stuck from this side. What does that mean? I don't want to look around this room because it is so annoying to navigate around this room. It is incredibly annoying. To navigate around this room. You know what? Screw it. I'm I'm done. I don't I don't want, I don't care what's behind this door. Carlac? Hey, Carlac's following. We made it out. I can't believe it. On it. Okay, well, we cleared out the morgue, except for the locked door that I can't figure out how to open, and I don't feel like navigating that annoying poison room to figure it out. So we're going to stop here.